here at Morgan uh, are uh, leading uh, the United States in a number of categories, as you know, in the sciences. Uh, we are number three in the United States, as I told Secretary Bolden, in producing uh, African-American engineers. Uh, we're number one in the state of Maryland. Uh, we have uh, one-third of our students here who graduate, uh, graduate in STEM fields. Uh, and 36% of our students who graduate from Morgan go on to graduate in professional schools. Thank you very much for the hospitality. We've, we've had an opportunity, we were over with some of the folk that, that are in chemistry and biology and everything else, looking at some of the work that's being done with the undergraduates here, uh, right down on the Patuxent River. And so it's really, it's exciting for me to be here in, in the School of Engineering. Uh, you know, you have a record that's incredibly, that you should be proud of. And it's one of the reasons that NASA chose Morgan as a, as a major research partner. The story of Morgan, the story of historically black colleges and universities in America is the story of overcoming overwhelming odds to give African American students the opportunity to reach their full potential. Here in the visualization lab we work on with the AR drone which is located here and I'm also constructing my own unmanned air vehicle and actually we have a video over there uh, that's actually using the Microsoft Connect but the AR drone uh, we use different mobile devices and joysticks to control it. And the video you're seeing now is on um, gesture-based actions. And I'm actually using those gesture-based actions to control the UAV as you see here. The National Airspace is currently the air transportation system that we have. Um, it is very complex, so we're, what my goal was to break it down, make it more understandable. We have um, the different models, the components that will make up the National Airspace system. Um, again, we want to look at making it simplistic, understandable for users, for everyone that will use this technology that they're trying to use to um, create the new transportation system, um, something called the next gen, next generation. Um, what they're trying to do is they're taking away the old technology, which is the ground-based um, radar towers, and they're going to a satellite base, um, going from air traffic control to going to an air management system. How did you get involved? Because this is big to us. Yes. Okay. Um, I was interested in, you know, trying to find something creative on the systems approach with engineering and using the classes that I went through undergrad, and so I wanted to do a real life project. Thank you very much.